Monday here in Tokyo, uh, the government and Tokyo Electric Power Company announced that they were going to dump 11,500 tons of contaminated water into the ocean directly. And the reason is that they've run out of storage space because they're pouring so much water into the reactors to cool them. And each time they do that, they create more contaminated water with various radioactive materials in it. They claim they're going to let go uh, some of the least contaminated water first uh, to free up more space. Uh, but this is a long-term problem and this is a short-term solution. Uh, there have been a lot of questions about the quality of the data that's come out. There's no shortage of it. Uh, the regulators, uh, the nuclear power company itself, the government, are all putting out various statistics in huge quantities. Uh, they've had some mistakes uh, that they've corrected. They over-reported numbers and they then had to retract them. Um, things can be sloppy. Uh, they're doing everything in real time. They're collecting a huge amount of data. And my feeling is that they're releasing too much data all at once and not putting it in context for people. And it may be a cultural issue and it may be uh, a media issue as well. Uh, the Japanese newspapers tend to just print whatever the government says. So the front pages of most of the newspapers are just really taken from the briefings. But people outside of Japan, and particularly in the Western media, want some context. They want to know if things are getting better or worse, whether there was a setback, whether it's going to take six months or a year or five years. All those things to set expectations are really important. Mm -hmm.